Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to my channel. So I have been MIA for the last two whole freaking months. Now I did not want it to sound like an excuse but it is because of work. Now I have told this like a bajillion number of times but I do have a 9 to 5 corporate full time job and I am thankful and grateful that I am still working from home. But then recently I have got like a new role which is in addition to the existing role that I have right now. So it was not hectic but my plate was kind of full. So by the end of the day I was so mentally exhausted that I could not do anything else apart from laying down and watching some Korean drama or some anime and sleeping. And if I did not have the weekend to myself I would have gone insane. Now nothing has changed right now but then and I have been trying to work on my time management skills so hopefully you'll be able to see more of this more often now coming to today's video it is a request by Joyta and girl I am so sorry I know you requested this like two months back and uh, you would have already bought the product already but nevertheless I'm still going to be doing a review and a lip swatch of the Milani ludicrous lip crayon and the lip glosses as well now I have picked out uh, four shades from the lip crayon and two shades from the lip glosses as always check out the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference I'm NC40 in MAC. Now before we can get into all the good stuff do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so you're notified whenever I upload and now let's jump right in the video. Ah, I missed saying this. first let's talk about the lip crayon now this is how the packaging looks like which is color coordinated with golden writing and a black cap at the bottom is the shade name and number and it is a retractable type of a lip crayon which is my preferred type of lip crayon now like i mentioned before i have picked out four shades out of the 14 shades that they offered in india and they are priced at 950 rupees so 1.4 grams of product currently they are available only on hkmakeup.com and i think i saw it on amazon as well and now moving on to the lip gloss now the packaging of the lip gloss it is transparent plastic chubby tube with a black cap golden writing and at the bottom you have the shade name and number and the applicator it is a very very flat leaf shaped applicator and like i mentioned earlier i have picked out two shades out of the eight shades that they offer and they are priced at 950 rupees so 4.5 grams of product now these are available on hkmakeup.com and on nika as well now before we can talk about the formula let's move on to the lip swatches Darling, you
Okay, so let's talk about the lip crayons first. Now the formula of the lip crayon, it is very soft and buttery and it glides on very smoothly when applied on your lips and it settles into a soft, comfortable matte finish. Now the shades that I picked for myself, the four of them, I love all of them, especially the first shade which is No Curfew, which I have applied in the inner portion of my lips and the outer portion I have applied so obsessed and the combo looks sublime. Now one thing that I noticed is that the lighter shades, you have to go over a couple of times to build it up, wherein the darker shade, the darkest one that I have, that one, it glided on so smooth in one swipe, it gave full opacity, so that is just something to bear in mind. Now these are surprisingly quite long lasting provided you do not have any heavy or any greasy oily food i'll quickly insert a video of how it looked once i had a very heavy lunch and i have used the darkest shade in this and you can see that the outer line alone is remaining wherein if you press your lips together you are good to go but then with the lighter shade i don't think that is kind of possible but yeah just fyi now these are not transfer proof like for example they do transfer a little bit so you can expect it to smear on your mask a little bit and these are surprisingly easy to remove as well you can just use a dry tissue paper and it actually comes off pretty easily now comparing it to the other retractable lip crayon that we have in the market now the one that i own is the maybelline one now that is priced at 599 rupees for 1.2 grams of product so it's a little bit less quantity but the pricing is quite less however maybelline is not cruelty free 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 and milani is cruelty free wherein the other one which i have is the k beauty one that is priced at 7.99 rupees for 1.8 grams of product and the quantity is a little bit higher and the pricing is lower and it is cruelty free as well so yeah so the only con that i could see is a price point of 950 rupees however on hedgehoggymakeup.com i have seen the price drop all the way down to 750 rupees and even right now i think it's like 800 ish or 850 ish rupees i'm not very sure but it is at a lower price than its normal mrp so yeah if you're interested in picking these up i would highly suggest pick it up when it is at a lower pricing and last but not the least let's talk about the glosses now these are super thick super glossy and super shiny at the same time it is not sticky at all which is like a huge plus point so when you press your lips together it doesn't feel sticky or goopy it doesn't have that weird thready thing going on so that is a huge plus point and oddly enough i love the flat leaf shaped applicator which is quite flexible and it can apply the lip gloss evenly throughout and even the sharp edges or the tip it is perfect to like line your lips with the gloss or you know get into the crevices and everything so it just works perfectly fine now coming to the shades especially the shade whatever which is my personal favorite that has like a peachy tone to it and it has blue and pink specks on it like it's like a shimmery particle it's not a glitter kind of a particle so you do not have that grainy or textured feeling on your lips but it gives immense shine at the same time and the shade so fly it is actually a dupe of the pat mcgrath uh, lip gloss gloss in the shade flesh 3 and that i was quite impressed on how pigmented that was so it was completely pigmented and it glided on so well it does not have any shimmer particles or anything it is just a pure gloss and this will suit all skin types so even if you're on the darker side where you have this beautiful chocolatey kind of a skin tone it will look beautiful on you as well now this one again the price point is quite high and like i mentioned before you can just wait for the price to drop down on hjk makeup and uh, probably pick it up at that time so being a lip gloss obviously it will transfer and i would not suggest it wearing it with a mask because it will get smudged all over your mask and have that weird feeling on your mask with your touching your skin so i would not suggest that at all but otherwise it is a nice gloss and i feel it's a good alternate for fenty glosses because fenty is not available in india so yeah it's a very good alternative to fenty now, unfortunately, I cannot compare it with any other gloss that we have in the market because the only other gloss that I own is a Fenty one. And before that, I owned the Maybelline Diamond Shine. I think it has been discontinued and that was 10 years back. 
So yeah, 2020 is wild. I have deliberately picked up lip glosses. <laughs> so yeah, these were my opinion about the Milani Ludicrous lip crayon and lip gloss as well. So guys, this wraps up today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so they're notified whenever I upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests. I will try my best to that for you as well as follow me on my socials which is it's Shania on Instagram and it's Shania on Twitter as well. So until the next time, take care. Bye.